We came from every corner of the country with a common purpose. Go, 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 go. To bring the war to Hitler's doorstep. <laughs> Rack them up and knock them down. Let's rack them up and knock them down. Hey pilots, I'm my Japan, as you know, probably, and uh, that's another Let's Fly Conquest, and today we're gonna fly in BVP-203, Heavy Fighter, on tier 8, in German Tech Tree, available only in Premium Store, currently in a half price. Um, so, what we know about this machine, have huge engines, turboprop and jet, it's a hybrid engine, very fast plane, uh, can reach top speed, uh, in here I have 913 km per hour, but our, our maximum speed is our dive speed, so it's 900 km per hour, of course I specialize this machine, that's that's the reason now. Armament, we have uh, two 30mm cannons, two 13mm heavy machine guns and two 15mm heavy machine guns. So it's very powerful, we can go head on with any other heavy fighter in a game, of, of course, except the one with uh, equipped with rockets. Uh, any plane equipped with rockets is of course deadly, but other than that we can go head on with everyone. Okay, cut. Or maybe, you know, usually I, I cut this part to make the video shorter, uh, but uh, if I just get into battle so quickly, so we leave it like that. Um, so what we have here, airbase in the middle, two rocket bases and two garrisons. We have uh, four players against four players, am I right? Yes. All right. So. Um, that's not my first attempt. I'm trying to get this video like it's fourth, fourth battle I'm trying to do uh, to show you. And another way to play in a heavy fighter, um, usually we need to cap the sectors as quick as possible uh, in order to win the game. 
but we can also focus on defending sectors, specifically like battle like this, where I have uh, players in a bombers, enemy have players in a bombers, and my main role as a heavy fighter is to take down the bombers. So um, that's where I'm going to focus here. You see, 900 km per hour level flight. I just get some altitude now. And um, let's see. Oh, bomber in the middle. That's rare. Let's go after him. And I have a tail. That's no good. That's actually shitty position. Being behind the bomber and with the planes on my tail. This is the. How did I survive that? Ah, this is a piggy heavy fighter. Yeah. Okay. If I be lucky, I may survive this. Yeah. All right. So my build here is for speed, not maneuverability, so that's kind of problem if I'm getting into the turn fight with any other heavy fighter. E250, that's a bot. Go on, head on. Holy shit. Fuck sake. You see, um, bots are not so stupid. If they see that you are so low HP, they're not gonna avoid you. Uh -huh. that's <laughs> so he's alive, I'm not. Okay. What else interesting I want to say about this machine? Well, um, those cannons. Uh, basically, the plane is difficult to play because those cannons are, are different range. Um, so we have to be able to use those 30 millimeter cannons in a range first, and then we switch into auto fire when we get close to the enemy. And this RB-17 is going actually for our rocket base, and that's the sector I'm going to defend now. And he is trying to defend himself. He just show his back and he's on tail gunner now but we have such a superior firepower that yeah I should win that now die you Jesus Christ what he did to me like engine pilot everything <laughs> okay but um, yeah taking out bombers it's not easy job but uh, this plane is perfect for it uh, it's a pure heavy fighter and um, so we have three sectors now, which is great, but I didn't capture any of this. Because <laughs> this first bomber, um, first time I destroyed this bomber, he was out of the airbase, so out of the sector. Okay, we do some ME 262. We have to be careful with these guys, yeah? Uh, we can ambush him. If you build yourself maneuverability, you can even try to turn, but um, yeah, don't go head on. J7W2 I would like to repair myself, but that's not gonna happen. Too many planes here. Ooh! Right, I did actually get repaired. That's great. So I can go after Bomber, which is just over there. Falcon, have a bad luck. Pilot repair. And there you go. This time he didn't cause me too much damage to my plane. Now there is a bot bomber as well here. I wouldn't be worried about Bob. No, avoid that. And I get a hit with rocket or nearby rocket explode. You see my HP just drop dramatically. Well, that's the opportunity. I'm gonna kill the IL-20 and then I go back to the heavy fighter. Or not with damage pilot. Oh, all right. He knocked himself out. <laughs> okay, pilots get ready to go. I see accuracy is better now. Um, we dropped the bomb definitely here, but we are too high now, so it's fine. Bomber is coming, yeah. Now, we don't have much HP, so we have to be careful. We try to attack him from below now. If he lose a lot of HP now, it is actually, so we can go after him now to finish off. But that's risky. Uh-huh. 60 HP left to me. 
Um, so you see how this battle is going? I'm defending the rocket base. And um, quite often this is, this is not a good tactic. This is bad if you stay on one sector and killing bots. But what I'm doing here, I'm killing the human player in a bomber. And for this bomber, this sector is most important. Now, I killed this bot because uh, that gave me extra 40 capture points to defend this sector more, to have more capture points. Um, just uh, keep coming here. Bomber's going on low altitude now, so but I'm very low on HP. But we, I think he is just desperate to get this now. Let's go after him. Risky. He's not on his tail gunner, that's for sure, because I could be in trouble now. Now, now maybe he is, but it's too late. Yeah, so it's look like it's gonna be perfect battle. That's that's the battle I was looking for. Um, so sometimes you have this kind of battle that defending sectors can give you win, can give you good result. Oh, it would be nice if I had a chance to repair myself. You see, with ME262 we have to be careful. Of course that's a bot, but even bot can kill you with rockets easy. So never go head on. Okay. I'm thinking what we can do now. Everything's perfect. Like we have sectors. My bomber is doing its job as well. So I see the enemy bomber on the mini map. <laughs> he keep coming for the rocket base. Good for me. And square line. That's the decisive engagement. Come on. Actually, the bot from the air defense aircraft from uh, from uh, air air base helped me. Now that's it, he is finished now. So we knock him out, that's great. He's not gonna come back to this battle. We're gonna go after this bomber because it's an easy target, easy credit. And we're winning anyway. So you see, this is a perfect example how heavy fighter going after bombers can win the battle. It's not always the case, you, sometimes you need to cap more, it depends what kind of bomber, what kind of heavy fighter, it's obviously um, many different um, circumstances are into it, but uh, in this case, this is pure heavy fighter, and uh, you need to be very good marksman, not like I'm here. He reached the, I, I turn after him because he's ignoring me, you know, um, only two of them, oh my god. Now we definitely need to disengage. Okay, we we'll get back to this business. Oh, so slow and so low. Boom. Yes. So. Okay, but they, we we lost the sector. Okay, but. Uh, Oh, we get another rocket base. Our bomber is doing a really good job, see? 13,360 capture points, that's good. But the thing is that he doesn't have opposition. There is no heavy fighter which going after him. So he can freely go around and do these capture points, okay? But the enemy bomber had me. <laughs> All right. So that's what I was trying to show you. BVP is excellent heavy fighter, but it's difficult to play because he have those... Uh, cannons with different range and you need to be like a sniper, very good aiming is acquired for this plane. It's not for an experienced pilot, definitely not, they're gonna struggle. Um, and this plane need a specialization also to be fast enough uh, to deal with those bombers. But it's excellent, I don't regret that. Uh, that I Actually I didn't bought this one, I have this one from the event, I get it for free because uh, there was event and I had sets of missions, I had that done and that's why I get this plane, but since then He's um, keep coming to the premium star from time to time, and uh, I highly recommend this if you like heavy fighters, German heavy fighters, and you are experienced pilots, that's definitely a good choice. You can get a lot of credits, and it's very good for training also. We have in this machine um, very, very good camouflage, which, give you, which can give you extra 
um, six times, uh, which can give you 20% more of crew experience. Uh, see, uh, this is this is um, RB17, which has been killed six times, and that's why he's not in top of the um, score line. Um, and I have zero fucking sectors and 360 uh, in defending. This is amazing. So that's a good example. Not always like that. So don't take that as a rule. From time to time, you may have a match like this that you can focus on defending and that will win the game for you. Um, but yeah, that's what I was trying to show you. Uh, BVP203, excellent machine, very fast, very powerful. Um, with the tail gunner, which can help you in some situations, so uh, highly recommend it, and it's one of my favorite heavy fighter in a game. Okay, guys, thank you very much for watching. I hope you like it. If so, please leave me a like and subscribe for future content, and have a good hunting in BVP203. Take care, guys.